Good morning. I'm calling from, I'm emailing a movie from Tucson, Arizona. It's November 2nd, day before election. And guess what? I have a complaint to a company named Polaroid. And I'm going to let you know what's going on with this company. But uh, I called up Polaroid on a bad TV that they have that I have. It's a year and three months old. And I called them up and I asked them what they're going to do about it. There's a, there's a line in the bottom of this television. It's a beautiful 32-inch combination DVD Polaroid television, and uh, they don't want to do anything about it. Now I'm, I'm going to I'm going to show you what what they their answer is. Here it is. heard those words? That's what they say to me when I try to call them up and explain the problem. Now this is the TV here. Whoops, we got a few things going on. It looks like Lindsay Lohan there. And uh, that would grab your attention. And then here's uh, her twin, Lindsay Lohan. Oh, that's Lindsay Lohan too. I didn't know that. They're broadcasting. That's public domain, so Lindsay don't mind me putting her on the camera. But let's get back to the problem. It's Polaroid. That's the problem. They're out of Bedford, Massachusetts. And I actually think Hoover owns them. And they're they're going to build a $5 billion, $50 billion plant there in the year 2012 in Bedford, Massachusetts. Now, I want to, I'm going to say something to you. You probably heard about Discount Tire, where this little old lady takes a tire and throws it right through the showroom window because she's not happy with her tire. Well, you know, these guys, uh, these Polaroid people, they don't know me. And I'll take my television and throw it through them uh, showroom window. I'll get a hold of them, and they'll be sorry they ever mess with me. I talked to one of their agents on the telephone and all they said was wow you had a, a year and 90 days well that's so far away did you buy the extended warranty I said sir we're talking about a television gone bad with a year and 90 days and you don't want to do anything about it there's a fracture in the in the in the, uh, in the tube in, in the screen a line going across the bottom now this could have happened in the middle of the first year because people were mentioning to uh, me about this line, and I thought, well, I'll call him up. Well, I did call him up. Well, it just happened to be 90 days too late, because Polaroid only, no wonder Polaroid has so much money. They don't take things back. Did you ever Google Polaroid? Google Polaroid complaints. Consumer reviews for Polaroid. My God, fourth replacement in nine months. Second one, stop selling junk. Third one, idiots. Fourth one, live CD platform Walmart. Customer service, lesson learned. 32, uh, 32 inch Polaroid television, very bad news. I'm telling you, don't buy Polaroid. They're no good. They don't back their products. And I'm tired of it. You know, I mean, you spend a lot of money. These, this is not a cheap Polaroid. It's a $600 Polaroid television with the uh, DVD player. And I, I'm playing the chipmunks just because uh, of what they're saying. They're saying F you, and I'm saying that's how they talk to me on the telephone. I even speak to one of their supervisors. And you know, it's only three minutes on this. I'm going to give you a little more on this. I'm going to tell you what I'm going to do to this guy. I am going to... Whoops! There's another picture on the television. My God, what's that? Oh! Well, you know, at least I get some pictures. You notice those lines going through the Polaroid? It's a piece of crap, this Polaroid television. And I hope they know that they're fooling with the wrong person when they do that. I got a friend of mine. I'm going to call him in. You see that guy? That's King Kong. <coughs> I'm going to ask him to visit uh, Polaroid Air in Bedford, Massachusetts, and tell him what he thinks of him. He'll tear up the place. And next to him, you know who that is? That's Mariah Carey. And you know, I'm an artist, and I painted that uh, painting. And uh, that that's her, and actually she's holding... Uh, in in uh, record, uh, if you remember her record, she was holding a lollipop. Well, I decided to improvise and collage and put a uh, micro, a uh, speaker, uh, a, uh, a microphone, a mic in her hand, in her right hand, and uh, I stripped her of her clothes and put some uh, some uh, jeans and a black bra, and I thought she looked pretty cute. This is Maria Carey about 10 years ago. And you notice how her blonde flowing. She's a very pretty girl and she's a very good singer. Now she's on that Polaroid TV and she says, get me out of here. I don't want to, I don't want to be in a Polaroid TV. Now Lindsay Lohan, you know, I've showed you her before. She, uh, oh, look at that, look at that, wow, now there's a girl. Um, you know, she's trying to be Marilyn Monroe in this and I'm just lucky enough to catch these on uh, YouTube or somewhere when uh, she did that Marilyn Monroe stint. Now look at that, isn't that gorgeous? She's a gorgeous girl. I mean, look at, look at, look, look, look at there. 
Uh, Lindsay, you should be in the movies. I mean a lot of movies. And drop your stupid dad. Okay, let's get back to Polaroid. Polaroid is a company that I thought was a good company. If you remember years back they made the Polaroid camera where you could take a picture and uh, flip it around and dry it off and it becomes a picture. Well, Polaroid, uh, they're different now. It's a whole different company and I think, I'm not sure, I think Polaroid's owned by Hoover. And uh, Polaroid fails to honor their warranties. We have consumer complaints from Lawrenceville, Georgia, somewhere in LA, Memphis, Tennessee, Wentzville, Missouri, Brooklyn, New York, Salem, New Hampshire, Susicana, Susquehanna, New Jersey, Baltimore, Maryland. Here's one I won't have had read other reviews before spending so much money on a TV that was operational for one year. Now that's funny. That's what my TV was op operational for one year. They make these televisions to last one year. Then, then they know. Then first thing they say, well, did you buy the extended warranty? Well, you know what they make on the extended warranty. That's cash. That's cold hard cash. Most, most everybody don't use the extended warranty. But you know why? A lot of times the TV. Lucky for them, it doesn't go bad. You know, they pocket that cash. You don't think they'd refund you the, the extended warranty when uh, when uh, they didn't have to come out? Oh, no, no. That's how they're buying that $50 billion plan in Bedford, Massachusetts. Now, I'm going to spend a little more time and give you some a little bit of fun stuff here. This is my friend of Charles. And listen to the words. You hear what they're saying? That's what Polaroid wants to do to me. He, they want to F me. And boy, they did it. 90 days, this young man says. Well, that's so far away from a year. My friend, 90 days from a year is only 90 days. They won't honor. They don't care. They got their money, and they're spending it. They're, paying, they're buying a $50 billion plan in Bedford, Massachusetts. Now, I'm, I've gone seven minutes, and most uh, uh, YouTubes run three minutes, four minutes. But I want to put my point across. Be very careful if you decide to buy a Polaroid television, because they suck. The company sucks, they're cheap asses, and they're no damn good. And this is, I'm, I'm Gene Freeman, I'm signing off from Tucson, Arizona. And I do hope they try to sue me, because that's what I want. I want a lawsuit, because I'm going to expose them for what they are, a crappy outfit that makes crappy products. That's the end. And don't forget to vote tomorrow. This is Gene Freeman going away from Tucson, Arizona, and you all have a nice day, and don't buy Polaroid, please.